Rutisol's Grand Flam Olympia range with protective roof, six spit rotisserie, and a DEB base cabinet. Two glass doors. and also glass side doors. Six spit, intermediate drip pan, which can be placed at various levels. The removable bottom drip pan for ease of cleaning. The burners with the burner shields, easily removable for cleaning. On the right hand side next to the burner is the pilot light and thermocouple. Remove the burner shield and you can see the burner. Replace as such. Behind you have the cast iron plates with the ceramic wicks. Above, the refractive brick. The spits are driven by chains on either side of the unit. When you open the side door, these will stop. Closing the side door, they will start again. We'll now look at the switches on the unit. The switch on the far left is the main on and off switch. When this is turned on, the fan light will go on for a period of five seconds. The second switch controls the light. And the switch furthest to your right controls the vertical spit system. The third switch will control the motors. Position one being one spit on the right hand side, position number two being one spit on the left hand side. And position three being both spits together. This applies to the third, fourth and fifth switch. We'll now proceed to light the burner. We'll light our gas lighter as such, approach ourselves to the pilot light and hold down for 10 seconds. For a large flame, we'll turn it to large flame. And for a small flame, we'll turn it down to small flame. The cooking process on the Olympia range is the same as a Grand Flamme Millennium. For more information, please go to rutisol.com.